And let me say, this issue of drug and substance abuse. I sat down with President William Ruto, my boss, and we agreed that there was a problem, and a big problem. And the president asked me to lead the war against this drug and substance abuse. And among the regions that were very affected was the Mount Kenya region. We were losing an entire generation in another 10 years. And the president asked me to lead the wall, and the matter went all the way to the cabinet, and we agreed what we must do. And I put together a multi-agency team under my leadership, and we have made substantial progress. And our children are back to work. And we shut down all bars that were selling in city brews. And people have been very happy. So when I started hearing last week that some people want to interfere with that work, one, I heard that our local member of parliament has directed the security officers in Karatina purporting on orders from above to reopen our bars. One, a member of parliament cannot instruct security officers. And if the security officers in this region are taking instructions from a member of parliament, we shall discipline them. But to my shock, I came last night. This morning, as I was walking around in the village, I came face to face with what I knew a year ago. I found some young men at 6 a.m. in the trenches drunk, which means some bars have been reopened. Let me say this. Let me say this. One, I've never missed a single cabinet meeting, so there is no decision that has been made by the cabinet to stop the war against illicit war. Number two, the last meeting I chaired 10 days ago, we are on course. Let me say this because it's important that I say so. One of the most successful interventions that has made the people very happy in this country and in this region with the government of President William Ruto was a war against illicit brew. Anybody stopping that war or undermining it is setting the president and the government against the people. And if you people at the interior think that you want to interfere with this very successful program so that maybe you undermine the deputy president because he's the one who has been leading this war, you are effectively undermining President William Ruto and his administration. And let me say, Mr. President, if you allow overzealous officers at Harambe House with a political scheme to interfere with this war against illicit rule, those people, those officers will set you up against the people. Now what to what a kosanisha raiz na wananchi. True or false? Nini mukifikiria muna siyasa muna chesa hapo. Ati kwa sababu hii program regarding a shagwa di wanaongoza, hamepata umarufu. Ati mufungue zile vilabu zilikuwa zinausa kwa mebaya. 
ndio watoto waanze kukufa mtakuwa mnamhujumu na kumkosea rais William Ruto na serikali yake I want to say and I want to advise nikiwa nikiwa hapa kanisani the popularity or otherwise of our administration would depend on the interference or non interference with the war against East Bruce these people the women our children parents have been very happy with the government kwa sababu watoto wetu walikuwa wanapotea nyinyi mkikaa hapo mtumie wabunge ambao wamepotea njia atemfugue vilabu zile zilikuwa zinauza kwa mebaya ya kuua watoto watoto waanze kulala kwa mitaro watoto waanze kukufa kwa pombe mutakuwa mumemkosea rais and the political damage you do to the president and the government will not be able will not be repaired nenda amera adwashio mara ugate ila mwisho hii guru ile ile ola gagashia na shitu ciana ciaje gukua ni president murahitiria na kumuhurithania na atimia na ashiari Mugeshi ya kule siasa muratha kahau Ishu ni siasa juru muno 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 And I want to tell our officers If there are such instructions they should be in writing So that we know who is giving those instructions I would like the DCC Madera East and Madera West to tell us If they have any written instructions To reopen the bars that were selling in city bruce as it has happened this morning is my lowest day in the last one year when i have found our children back in the trenches at 6 a.m. in the morning what are we doing what kind of politics are we playing how are we going to play with the lives of our children This is a program that the president gave me for one year and we have succeeded to save an entire generation. And you want because of stupid primitive politics to undermine that program thinking that you are undermining the deputy president. What happens to our children? What are you going to tell their mothers who are so happy with what the government had done? please people at interior stop those games and i want to say let our officers not take instructions from members of parliament purportedly on from higher authorities let anybody who wants to stop this exercise let anybody who believes that those bars should be reopened put it in writing And I want to say the officers who are serving in in Kenya please the era of orders from above are gone if anybody wants to give instructions let them be in writing but if a decision has been made without my knowledge that the war on illicit bruce should come to an end and people should sell it sit bruce i want to disassociate myself from that decision because i am not part of it and i cannot be part of such a decision i cannot be part of such a decision because i know what is good for the people and i believe that president william ruto is not aware of that decision but some people are using his name to damage his reputation and standing before the people of Kenya and i want to ask officers in government we are just struggling to recover from the debacle of the finance bill why do you want to start another war 
with the people of Kenya. Sasa hii ndio tunangangana kupembeleza wa Kenya watulie kwa sababu ya makasiriko ya mambo ya finance bill. Sasa tena mnataka kutangazia serikali vita ingine na wamama na wazazi kwa mambo ya pombe haramu. Sasa nyinyi ni rais mnasaidia ama ni kumwangusha? Eh? Hao watu ni rais wanasaidia ama ni kumwangusha? I can't believe it. You know I I I I can't believe it that a government that I serve as deputy president some people can stop the war on illicit brews and allow bars to sell poison to our children. It's unbelievable. Na mimi niseme eh adwaito ni dili muraika ndi mudu wa mahitia maingi mahitia maria daneka mudekere todo atongoria yothe mathuri twanyirire ni ndamureheire ni uhoro wa ma eh leo ni murona ngirugura metugura menayo kamurehera mwanake kamwiro yo ni mwega leo kionei Ateidavu maidia ya higiruo Shiana shito iraro gama Ira adhera Ira agia na kehariro Ira ashoka meshie Kanidhera akena Atimia mara akena Ashiari mara akena Ateweo dhuretu wane muige Uga vye kuera mawo za madhiri kari Ateidavu ila iro agaga shiana Ateidavu ila iro agaga shiana Shiana shito ikue Eh? Muda kere ne hara damu hiti diri. Muda kere. Juki ya tiriri. Juki ya tiriri. Weka mahiti ya tiyoru. Udo weka ta? Tugeo kahu turadi. Makewe roka. 